can your machine do one hit machinery of complex parts? Well, with the DVF 5000, you can. It's, it's a new to our portfolio. With this new model now, it gives you a 630 table. Floor space in a lot of factories now is, 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 is really important. So the 5000 had the 500 table, where on the same footprint now we've got 630. So for them sort of uh, larger components now we'll be able to fit them within this, this range. Richard, the one show this week, the, the main aspect here is about one hit machine, isn't it? Very capable machines uh, showing off, you know, the, yeah, the ability to be able to make complex parts very, very easily. This DVF 5000 is a new, mark, uh, a new launch from BN Solutions, the Mark II. Where, where does it fit for you and, and, and for the guys that work with you? Okay, so the, the DVF 5000 Mark II, um, it's, it's a new to our portfolio. Um, we've got the, the 4000s, the 5000 Mark I, um, the DVF 6500, the DVF 8000. Um, a few of the customers were approaching us um, and the 5000 was kind of on the limits of what they were doing. So with this new model now, it gives you a 630 table. So it just fits in between the DVF 5000, the 4000 and the 6500. Um, and why are we really targeting with customers with this is um, it gives you the ability to go up to 300 tools. So on our 4,000 and 5,000 um, machines, we only had 120. So for people that may be looking to branch into automation or with robots or uh, palletized systems, um, we've got the ability with, with that on that. Um, if you got that many tools, you'd then need some automation to go with it, wouldn't you, I suppose? Because you, otherwise you've got a lot of tools and you've not got enough parts to feed it. Yeah, correct. Yeah, so uh, and obviously the way that the market's going now, people are obviously looking to, to automate where possible. Um, and obviously, if, if you've got a machine within your, your range that's only got a limited amount of tools, having, having up to uh, 300 there will obviously allow you to, if you don't buy the machine straight away with automation, you can obviously retrofit at a later date. Okay. Yeah. The main difference then with the Mark II, is, is it that working envelope? It is, yeah. So, so you've got a bigger table in a similar footprint machine. Correct, yeah. So one, one thing they used to make uh, alluded to there is the footprint of the machine because floor space in a lot of factories now is, 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 is really important. So the 5000 had the 500 table, where on the same footprint now we've got 630. So for them sort of uh, larger components now, we'll be able to fit them within this, this range. Uh, Rich, for, for, your, for your guys and, and, and for the UK on a whole, as, as you head that up from a sales perspective, where, where do you see the machine fitting then? Where's going to be that, that sweet spot for you? In, in, in overall with this BVF 5000? I think... Um, Obviously, the subcontractors, SMEs, uh, OEMs. Um, you can see from the demonstration we're showing now, we're showing the versatility of having three components in one setup. So I think the, the, the SMEs that are really looking in for, not particularly doing four, five axis simultaneous parts, but maybe they're looking at three plus two, four plus one, are really getting into that five axis market. So hopefully with the right price point and the availability is something we can really move on with in the UK.